Oops. Uh oh. All right. All right, so we're back with Kasha. Let me tell you what he's doing. He's over by me, laying down. He's already figured out. The problem with a dog like this is they're a fast learner. If you said, where's that? Why is that a problem? If they learn the wrong things, then, well, that's what they've learned. So that's what this jumping is in him. It's terrible, terrible. It's like little talons digging into you. So anyway, he had a very good trip to the park yesterday, though he did have a little failing when I went to go get him in the van and he didn't want to get in so I don't know if that was and then he started jumping around and trying to avoid me if you said what did I do I got sugar out and when he went to jump on her oh hi Kevin then I grabbed him so if you said that's what he did when he didn't want to do something no I believe that all right so we want to start getting him on the platform he's got the, the laying down part real good though how do we get him up there? Force him up there? Oh. Nope. <laughs> I didn't say I'd do anything. I just stood there. He said, what took you so long? I had to get all this grass out of my driveway. He said, how long does that take? For me, a long time. <laughs> he said, you still didn't get it all. I know. That's the sad part. So we need to build a little platform. No, oh, that'll give you guys something to do. That could be your project. And we want to get a little platform. This is going to help with... One, he's going to feel a little bit taller. That's what he's to jump. <laughs> and, you know, jumping is a normal finding in dogs. When people say, I don't want to jump in. You're going to have to go get a different kind of animal because it's a normal finding in dogs. It, it just, it gets misplaced. So if you said, what, are, what psychology are you using? I don't see you unless you're right there. So he wants to be seen. Oh. <laughs> anyway, so we need to build a little platform. We put it in the backyard. And it's good for in the house, too. All right, he's probably going to lay down. Let's see if I get him laying down. He started to do that, but then he caught himself because it doesn't work. So that's what we need. I've got him laying down now. If I sit down, he'll lay down. But we need to get it from a standing. He said that was his go-to technique to get attention. It was. And he said, why did he? It worked so well. It's important for people to it's like, they always put on Facebook. No response is a response. And that's what dogs. When people say, I'll say no, 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 no. There's no protocol anywhere that someone says no and the individual never does that again. He said, but there's protocols where if you tell them no, they do the exact opposite. Yeah, they do exactly what you said not to do. So that it's a process, but we'll get that. You said the subconscious dog is saying the level of success with this behavior is very high. Anyway, I don't know if you saw Kosh went to the park, but that went really, really well. And the delivered hand is already, he's that smart. He's already figured it out. But that's the problem you get into with a smart dog. They're figuring things out and whether you want them to. I didn't have any reaction when he scratched at me. Anyway, I'm going to start going to that little park, though. If there's nobody else there. Oh, hi, Georgios. If there's nobody else there, and I like that. Um, now he's over here laying down. I like that basketball court to train on. Sure, there was that one guy that walked into my shot. But other than that, honestly, it's my dream. Social distancing is my dream. When I go in public, I don't want people getting near me anyway. <laughs> Can I pet your dog? No. It worked out so perfect the other day. I told that woman, no, social distancing. All right, so I've got him. The picking up stuff is going great because he would even do it. Uh-oh. Uh -huh. He would even do it at the park. 
lot of times. Uh oh. They might. Res so that was a new thing too. That was a. Uh... And Elizabeth, if you're there, if you're not busy having your kitchen torn apart by those workmen, something like this is good. If you said it's a king, it's it's a King's Road merch key ring. But it's got the cloth on there, and I just bent it in half. Uh-oh. If you said, Kevin, if you said, listen, our family had some Easter uh, stuff in mind for Kosh. No problem. I'm on top of it. Uh-oh. And these key rings are good, too. They're removed before firing just because of the cloth. Okay, so if you said, how are we going to get him picking up the, and that's where your ponytail band comes in handy. So I don't have any, po oh, your wife's got to have some around there. Anyway, <laughs> if you said, is he going to pick it up? I haven't tried it yet, but I would assume he's probably going to do it. Is that the cutest thing ever? Add some bunny ears and eggs and we're all set. <laughs> we're all set for a viral video. You can see what he's doing. The engagement is going great. I just still, I remember that Sunday where I said, hey, don't want to do anything, I'm putting him up. If he said he remembers it too, he must. thing I've seen all day. <laughs> you said you watch crime shows all day. How could it not be? <laughs> all right, see so if you get him laying down. Yo, he's precious. All right, so now we can try the glasses without the now the glasses don't have the thing on there, so. Uh -oh. <laughs> the key to teaching a deliverer is have him do it as fast as possible. And so, that's why when he starts waving it around and stuff, I just, the worst thing to do, he's going to be perfect office dog, Kevin. He's going to be right under your desk or wherever it is you've got in there and drop a pen every here and there, and it's gonna be great. <laughs> every here and there, just let a pen roll off your desk. It'll be perfect. <laughs> Hours of family fun. Oh, put it right in my hand. He's gonna lay down. He's not even if you he I want you to understand that he's not even really aware of what he's doing. It's he's just now sort of starting to get into this routine. Of stuff that works. That's where you go wrong where they don't know what works. Oh, you had a few Easter eggs if you said, yeah, I do have some. <laughs> Luckily, I stocked up on all that stuff. Oh, my God, how cute. And he does have that idiosyncrasy of going from this side to that side. If you said, why? I don't know. Maybe the first time he did it, that's what he did. Oh, he's like he's like my butler. <laughs> I 
That's what I was going to have one time. Make your dog your butler. All right, so let me see. Put it on over here to see what happens. <laughs> He's such a cute dog. He said, What's it? it's a blinking thing. It works anymore. So I was going to do with Mac, though. I was going to put, um, I've got that glowing harness. I was going to go out before it got light out and, like, have him go get, you see how perfect he is, though. So. I was going to go make him, like, go get something in the dark wearing the glowing harness. Like, make him go get something that was glowing. All right, let me go get some more trees. We'll do it one more time. He's so cute. All right, let me grab some more treats, but he's going to lay back down. Or go get a drink. I'm going to go get the treats. But he's to the point now. He does have suspicions. He's suspicious that I'm going to go away. That's why he's watching me all the time. If I, if he, what he thought was I was going to say, come here, come here, come here, come here. They're, they're going to start ignoring you. They really are. Do I have to remind you? Do I have to tell you guys a story about the Pink Floyd concert again? <laughs> I don't even really like Pink Floyd that much. doing? When I came out, he was looking at the squirrel over there, but so you saw how quick it was for me to get him up on this platform. Just by going over there. He said, how, what these other people do is they drag the dog up there. They drag it, force it up there. said what happens the dog says to itself i can show you this video i should send you this video kevin this guy is dragging this dog to this platform over and over and over again if you said what happens the dog says to itself any place but this platform so now it's actually just running away if you said is it getting no this guy has like a 40 foot boat rope on it and he keeps dragging it back over there but it's, it's the complete opposite of that because what I noticed about dogs is if you act like you're going somewhere, they like to get there first. He <laughs> said, so how'd you figure that out? Trying to get out my door, my gate, my everything for my whole life. <laughs> So the platform is their little stage. And then I want, if I sit down, for him to concede and then to lay down. So when he jumped on me, 
I didn't have any reaction. No response is a response. It really is. And if I was to say, no, nah, no, nah, no, nah, no, nah, that's a response. All right, we can try the little default. We can do a little default delivery where I drop the stuff. So I'm kind of putting my little ponytail bands back on there. All right, and if you're there, Elizabeth, this is how I want you to do it. So setting them on the ground, you're sort of doing it as... I'm going to tell you guys, when I left the park yesterday, after I trained Honey, I must have put those keys in that Bass Pro Shop hoodie, which doesn't have a good pocket on it, so stuff falls out of it all the time. And I didn't even realize I dropped them. And as we were walking back to the van, Mac found them on the ground and started bringing them along with us. I was like, oh, my God. The practical application is unbelievable. I would have never known that they were there, and somebody would have found them and thought somebody lost their keys. Not realizing they're just dummy keys. He is such a good little guy. Oh, he's going to be a star. He's going to be a star. So if I sit down, he should lay down. If he said, what's the upside of all this? He completely believes all of this is his idea. If he said, is it? No, he's not coming up with any of this stuff. <laughs> he's not coming up with any of this stuff. Oh. <laughs> it's just like Amazon. It's just like Amazon. I think that all of this stuff that I'm buying is my own idea and that Nobody's going to stop me from getting this stuff. If he said, is it? No. I'm just falling victim to all their marketing strategies. <laughs> it's true. I intellectually understand that's what's happening, but I don't care. He doesn't intellectually understand that's what's happening. He just feels like it's all his own idea. Uh-oh. I'm not looking either. It's all a terrible accident. I just still can't believe Mac found those keys yesterday. tell him to do it. I just kept looking that way until he said to himself, what is it looking at? And that's what we're going to get the kids to do too, Kevin, because if you said, what you can't do, and this is why I tell people to train dogs, you cannot task people with making dogs do things they don't want to do. Because it's just going to fail. They're not going to do it. They're going to give up and the dog's not going to do it. But if you just, what we'll be able to do is just fold your arms up like this. Oh, he's ready to go get more stuff. He's ready for the three object drill. Anyway, his hot spot seems to be all gone. All right, let's just do it one more time. Oh my gosh. He's the cutest dog in the world. You need to get one of those stuffed toys made of him. It looks just like him. He said, why don't you point in all these things? They're hardwired. They're hardwired to follow. 
I say it all the time. I could go into town right now and start looking up in the sky. So, but people, what are you looking at? They can't help it. <laughs> He's the cutest dog ever. Anyway, all right, let me get a quick little video and it's going great though. I mean, he's he's falling for my marketing and that's what it is. You're marketing to the subconscious dog. These people, there was this thing on the internet yesterday, this woman, one of my nemesis is this British woman who reads from a script. She's awful. She's a hot mess. And so they're all about correcting the dogs. They're not they're terrible. None of them can even do the most basic things, but they all it's a Kruger Dunning effect thing. So she's on this video talking about how she lifted this dog up by the scruff of its neck, snarled at it, and threw it back down on the ground, and it's been perfect ever since. Oh, just like the mother does. If you said, does she breed dogs? No. I can assure you, the mothers don't pick them up off the ground by the scruff of their neck, throw them down on the ground, snarl at them, and then the puppy is obedient for the rest of its life. It's like, <sighs> if you said, did you say anything? Yes, I did. I said, she is a hot mess. And none of them can even do a simple train to retrieve and blah, blah, blah. If you said, do they care? Not really. <laughs> Not really. All right, let me do a quick video.